Hi, welcome to Namio. This is Jake. Um, today we're going to talk about Chinese slangs. If you want to impress your Chinese friends, if you want to sound like a native speaker, then I suggest you to don't skip this video. Stay tuned. And if you like the video, make sure to drop a like. And uh, if you like the channel, feel free to subscribe. That would be extremely appreciated. Thank you very much. Without further ado, let's get started. The first one is my mom, my mom, which means to purposely pretend to be cute. This word usually is used by people uh, when or before posting selfies or asking favors from others. This expression originally comes from the Japanese slang moe that refers to the feelings of strong affection towards usually female characters in anime, manga, video games, uh, pop idols, um, and so on. The common feature in all feelings of moe is that the subject of such feelings is someone that cannot possibly have a relationship with, like a fictional character or a pop idol, for instance. So, the, the character, or the kanji, I should say, mo in moe, in Mandarin is read mon, which uh, literally means sprout, but with the animal industry that became incredibly popular in China all over the years, the term mon starts to be associated with, uh, uh, with the animal world, with, uh, with the feelings of cuteness, that is typical of many anime series. And thus the expression Maimon, pretend to be cute, became extremely popular. The second is Gao Fu Shui. Gao Fu Shui. This is an adjective uh, to describe the ideal Chinese man. And so Gao means tall, but not only physical height, also high qualifications and uh, high social status. Uh, fu means rich, so a man with great wealth, and shui means handsome. So good luck with that, finding someone like that. There is also a female equivalent, which is bai fu mei. Bai fu mei. Bai uh, means white, and in this case white skin. Uh, which is a common feature of beauty in, uh, in China and in Asia. Fu, uh, as I said before, means rich, wealth, and Mei, it's beautiful. So Valentine's Day is coming. Speaking of that, uh, the third slang is Tang Sheng Ko. Tang Sheng Ko. Um, this is a, a slang that is used to describe singles men in China. Now, why they call single men single dog? The reason can be found in English, uh, since single is very similar to the Chinese pronunciation of shengou, uh, which means leftover dog. But the origin of this term is related to a very famous Hong Kong movie called Da Hua Xiu. So it's a movie about the legend of the Monkey King, um, a character from uh, Journey to the West, a famous Chinese novel published in the 16th century. So anyway, in this movie, there is an iconic scene where the Monkey King wife bursts into tears, says, he looks like a dog. Some people say that this phrase captures, shows the powerlessness of tens of millions of people between love, freedom, and responsibility, and thus the term single dog was born. The next one is niobi, niobi, which means cow's vagina. Yeah, you heard it right, cow's vagina. It's a funny slang that is used to say cool, awesome. So you might think, how in the world? this term turned from cow vagina to cool. So long story short, long time ago, butchers uh, blew up the pig skin to shave the hairs. And um, a cow uh, is an animal much more larger and bigger than a pig. 
So when someone says uh, he or she is able to blow up the cow skin, uh, he or she must be talking smack, talking big. So the term they used in the beginning was tre niu pi, which means literally blow up the cow skin. Um, sometimes speaking rudely sounds cool or impressive. So from tre niu pi became tre niu bi, which has the same meaning of talking big, and then niu bi, uh, which is awesome, cool. And at the end, at last but not least, we have a number, 88, which in Mandarin is pronounced baba, and uh, this means goodbye, because it's close to the English bye bye, and also there is another version which is baba liu, um, 886, but has the same meaning, and so 88. See you on the next video. Now we're